You have a Are you interview in to be a young woman. <gasps> Yay! Lost his shoes somehow at church. Where are your shoes, Gigo? Someone had put them out the window. They were in the bottom of the bushes outside of the church. You look like you have yeah. chicken pox. Is that chicken pox? And a yowie family! Yowie! Gigo, you want to come with me? Yeah! Okay, come on, let's go! First, I have to, to put on my shoes. I can't. I need someone it. to help me. Um, push it in. Uh, push it more in. Get even more in. As you want me to help you? Yeah. Whoa, bless you. I think this foot's bigger than the other one. This one I always struggle to get on. Or you got a size too small on this foot. Shoot. You're a growing boy, Machikino. Oh. Woohoo! You ready to go? Uh, yep. Okay, hey. Let's go. I love you. Love you. Bye. Bye. Today is our last day, very last day ever to do three hour church. Three hour church. Our church has made adjustments in our schedule and so now um, as of next week we will start doing two hour church. Today is the very last time that we actually do three hour church. And it's also my last time in primary today. That's oh, right, because yeah. next Sunday what happens? Um, I go to Young Women's. Young Women's? Women's? Whoa. So yeah, so that's the excitement today. Maybe I should comb my hair. What do you guys think? Maybe I should put a tie on. Probably. I got a lot of compliments on how I tie my tie <laughs> in our video about um, the LGBTQ. I, I want to actually it. show you guys how I actually tie my tie. Are you ready for it? Here we go. This is how I tie my tie. This is actually something I learned TikTok because it's a trend on TikTok and I'm trying to post more on TikTok. See, it's behind my neck. And then I go like this. Then I move my hair. Hey, you ready for it? This is how I tie a tie. You ready for it? Ready? 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 Look at that. That was fast, huh? See? I'm gonna put my collar down. The trick is, <laughs> I don't actually untie it. So the first time I tie it, I tie the, do it the, the way I showed it in the last video. And then I leave it and I just cinch, un, uh, like cinch it down, put it over my head and hang it on uh, a hanger upstairs, on a tie hanger, and then when I go to put a tie on, I put it back over, cinch it up, and it's done. Everybody to the car, yo. Those right there are footprints from a little Figo Seagull Migo Meister that um, lost his shoes somehow at church. Where is that guy? Gigo Figo, where are your shoes? Where are your shoes, Gigo? Where'd you lose your shoes? Seriously, he took off his shoes at church somewhere and we could not find them before we le left. So Sarah actually had to go back to church and she's trying to find his shoes right now. They were not where he was. <laughs> He's just managed to lose his shoes everywhere, including at church. We got home from church. Actually, we weren't even home yet. We got done with church and Kenyon had no shoes on. So we went to look in his classroom. There weren't any shoes. I talked to his teacher and she didn't have his shoes. So we're going to go back and look through the toy bin and see if his shoes are in there. Oh, there they are. <laughs> we found the shoes. Where? Someone had put them out the window. They were in the bottom of the bushes outside of the serious? church. Yes. Really? You're serious. Yeah. She said there's one little boy that either throws things out the window or throws things in the garbage. And luckily they weren't in the garbage because the garbage had already been dumped. But they were right out the window. <laughs> so yay for shoes. We don't have to buy any new church shoes. Canyon has the sweetest teachers and he's moving to a new class next week and they're going to be super sad that he's not in there. It was very nice of them to come over and look with me. Savannah has a meeting. All right. You have an you interview in to be a young woman. <gasps> Yay! And maybe you can get a temple recommend today too. You think? Yeah. You think? Right. I don't know. I don't know. That would be Let's so exciting. Okay. Wouldn't that be so cool? That mm -hmm. would. And then Danielle got a new temple recommend today and we could all go to the temple. Okay, go, go, go. Yeah.
Who wants to see my package? Me. I no. Daddy's so excited. He's been wanting this for oh, oh, a while. Oh, what, yeah. what is it? I what is it? Know. I know what it is. What I is think it? it's the GoPro. Yeah. GoPro. Yeah. Here, GoPro. The new yeah. GoPro. So we've oh, got um, Secure Digital. Micro Secure Digital. Okay, what's this? Your shoes. No, Something special. Okay, my oh, yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. Just, oh, take pictures of turtles. We need to go yeah. back to Hawaii. And I do. need to go Agreed. take Gigo to Hawaii. Let's take oh, him yeah, to Mexico. Okay, let's see you crack it. You have to use a knife to crack it. Oh. <laughs> Guess what? Eggs are white. That's a potato. These are, this is yellow. It's a potato. Eggs are sometimes First he said it was a pear, and, and then he says it's an egg. Oh, it's a pear? Taste it. We have pears downstairs in the freezer. Or in oh, the fridge, I mean. no. It's potato. not a pear. What is it? It's a potato. Oh, oh you got it right. No, it's a tomato. You got it right. It's a potato. So today I had the meeting with the new changes in the church because I'm going to Young Women's in January. I'm so excited. But pretty much all the meeting was about was he just asked me some questions about some things we should be staying on task with and what we should be remembering and just like stuff like that. And then we just talked about the new changes in the church and how we get to go to Young Women's in January, instead of waiting all the way till our birthdays, which we usually do, and then how we only have two hour church now. And we just talked about a little bit like that, and then what we need to stay on task with and remember. What's that supposed to be, Mommy? And we're gonna drink it, open up. <laughs> it's for the ham, it's called a glaze that goes on the ham. Can you say a glaze? Like a glaze on the donut. A glaze? A glaze. Okay, let's check the ham. Is this supposed to be looking about uh, like a pig? Dude, it, it is like a pig. pig. Oh, Dude, that's that's a pig. What is that on your sleeve? What? That. No, look. Is it a booger? Right there. Oh, you don't know about that? You don't know what it is? You don't know the story? Like an African thing? What is it, dude? It looks like an African sign. I want you to read it and tell me what you see. What do you see? So these are cufflinks. These aren't just normal cufflinks. These are special cufflinks. But there was another one on you, yes. your underarm. That's right. And so what you see there is it's either a W or an M. Oh. What is your name? As. What's your, what's your first name, your full first name? Johnny. And then what? Johnny Asbury's hair. Uh, what is as? It's not just as, it's what? Johnny Asbury. Do you know where you got your name from? Um, no. Your name came from your great, 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 great grandpa. Five great or four great, sir? Four great. Four great, great. great. It was that your. does look like a W. Yeah, it was your great, 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 great grandpa. His name was William Asbury. <gasps> That's where we got your name from. William Asbury Matthews. Your grandpa on mommy's side actually wore these. These were William Asbury's cufflinks. So grandpa gave them to me and I wear them every once in a while. So that's where we got your name from and guess whose these are gonna be one day? Mine. Yours. <laughs> Knew it. Whenever you're old enough to take care of them and not lose them, they're gonna be yours. Isn't that so cool? These are not just normal cufflinks. These are old, old, old cufflinks. What's these, alligators? No, I'm pretending this is a whale, and this is a whale that has sharp teeth. Whoa. And this is a whale that, that has bites Whoa. all over him. And this, I'm pretending, and this is a killer whale that, and his name is, it's lightning storm. This looks like a killer well it named lightning like storm. This really whale. looks like a killer well. And he goes, ah, stop! 
<laughs> Mommy? Go ahead, dude. What? Go ahead and go to the bathroom. Can you make sure Daddy doesn't steal my... <laughs> um, my food and not eat it? Uh, but why would I do that? You always do it. When I never do that. Bathroom. Mommy will make no, sure I, don't. I won't. It's that guy right there that does it all the time. No, it's not. Daddy, I want you to do that. <laughs> One fell on the floor, too. Daddy, stop it! <laughs> make sure he doesn't take it. Or Lizzie. Um, I'm not going to promise anything. Sorry. Okay, hurry. Go, go, go. Hurry. Go. The other night, me and mommy, we looked into the basement through the camera to see what was going on down there because I wanted to make sure you guys didn't leave the fire on and look what I found. A huge dog or something. Do you see it? What's underneath of the couch? Do you see something underneath the couch? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, so it looks like an eye. It's gone. It's coming back. There's gonna be two of them in a minute. What do you see on the couch though? Is it moving? See, it's moving. Yeah. You guys see it moving? No. Mm -hmm. It's totally moving. That thing on the couch is moving. Oh my god. See, gosh. look, it just it just it's kicked its leg out. Watch. Kiko, mm. it's Casper. No, that's it's, scary. Hey, I watch. think I know what it is. It's Casper. Watch. Look, can you see it moving on? Look at that. It's getting wider. See, look, its leg is out. That's so weird. It's, what? Its leg just went back in. I think I know what the Do you see what I'm that's talking on about? There. Now zoom in. I want to see it. I can't. I see it move. What is it? It moved. Oh my god. You see it? It's just a what the heck? It's the popcorn bag. No, it's not. See, it's not what's what, what, what is there? Why is it moving? That's a popcorn bag. What? Wait, it's no. not. Look, it's, it's gone. Not. It is gone. <laughs> Casper's so real. It's the bears. I think it's the bear that Lizzie's been playing with. It's Lizzie's dog that he got for Christmas. What's the problem, dude? Oh, yeah, buddy. Boy. Let's see. Oh, man. Turn dude, around, let's see. On, let's, dude, you look like you have yeah. chicken pox. Is that chicken pox? No, it's definitely not. What is that? Benadryl? This is Benadryl. He's allergic to Charlie. You're allergic to Charlie? It's because I'm touching the dogs, and it's because... Is it on your legs, too? Oh, yeah, behind back here. Let's see. It's weird how this Holy is the spot cow, that gets dude. itchy. Yeah, the only spot. Wow, Sarah. I know. You laid in the dog bed today. It's around your eye, too. You got some around your eye. Is it inside your ear? Dude, you have some inside your ear. Uh-uh. I can't. Okay, good night, dude. <laughs> Love you. Love you. So the last day of three hour church today, it, we had a lot of talking about it. It's, um, it's kind of a big deal because so much changes now going to two hour church. Um, when you take away an hour of people that are teaching and doing lessons and doing different things, a lot changes. And so it's going to be interesting to see what happens next week. It's going to be very interesting. What are you doing? What? Eating Nutella. She must be on her period, right? Yeah, I am. Am I right? <laughs> Sitting around eating Nutella. And what's happening here? It looks like Slapjack. <laughs> he kept doing this himself, Turn but he claws me, so I'm just doing it without Let's see. his claws. He's not going to do it with the camera on him. He might. <laughs> see? He, he thinks he's in trouble because he heard his name out in the hall and he thinks he's, he's in like, trouble. Does he ever get in trouble though, Charlie? Really, do you? Hey, well, look at that. He thinks. Do you he's ever in get in trouble? You big oaf. <laughs> I, checked, I checked on Polar. I just checked on Polar. He is fine. Um, I'm, he's such a spoiled old man. He is a spoiled old man. 75 spoiled. degrees out there. But we, I, I really want him to come in tonight because it's snowing out there and it's I like, icy. And I also feel bad of making him get out of the kennel because he gets in like this position and it's such a small space that it's hard for him to get up. And it's like. I feel bad being like, Polar, come in, come out of your comfortable You said hot. Polar, and Charlie got jealous. Do it again. <laughs> polar. <laughs> Say, come on, Polar. Come on, Polar. Polar, let's go. Polar. Where's Bobo? Bo? Where is he? Oh, come here, Bobo. Bo, Bo, Bo. Come here. <laughs> it's like, come on, Polar, get out of your nice, warm kennel with a comfy bed to That's warmer than walk. The house. That's warmer than the house to walk through the snow up some steps that are probably icy into the house and walk up a big staircase 
indoor room to lay on. I know. I don't want to make him either. Um, so I think I'll just wait for the next 20 minutes because I woke him up, made sure he was good. And so if he wants to come in, he'll come in. Otherwise, he's just going to have to stay out there. If he wants to come in, he'll come in. That's what he does. Who's ready to come in? Bobo. Hi, buddy. Bobo, Bobo, Bobo. You ready to come in? Hey, look. It's open. Look. <laughs> you scared Sorry. him. It's open. <laughs> See how fast he's moving right now? Yeah. Good night, Popo. I feel like I've accomplished something today. I haven't used my phone very much today. I think the longest I used it was, oh, don't fall. I want to say 20 minutes today. I looked on Instagram for a couple minutes. But other than that, I haven't been on my phone really. I'm eating Nutella and reading a book instead of being on my phone. Girl on her period is the greatest thing ever. But tomorrow's gonna be a party. Tomorrow's New Year's Eve. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to hang out with you. 